if the sum of the first p terms of an ap is q and the sum of first q terms is p then show that the sum of the first p plus q terms is minus of p plus q here sum of p terms is q and sum of q terms is p see sn formula is sum of n terms is n by 2 into 2a plus n minus 1 into d so here sp sum of p terms is p by 2 into 2a plus p minus 1 into d equals q in the same way here sq q by 2 Into two a plus n minus one into d. See here, in place of n, I need to substitute q. Q minus one into d equals p. Now these two values, what I'll do is I'll transpose towards right side here. These two. So what I'll get is here two a plus p d minus d equals. 2q. This 2 if I transpose, I'll get here 2q by p. This is equation one. Next here also 2a qd minus d. If I transpose these two values, q by 2, I'll get here 2p by q. This is equation two. So solving one and two. Solving equation one. And equation two. So here, two a plus p d minus d is two q by p. The other one is two a plus q d minus d is two p by q. So if I simplify this, here, here we'll get in this one. So if I simplify, eliminate. What I'll do, I'll subtract. So here minus minus plus minus d and d cancel. Two a two a cancel. So p d minus q d is two q by p two q by p minus two p by q. So in these two terms, if I take d common here, I'll be left p minus q. In right side, if I take LCM PQ, see here I have P, so I need to multiply Q, so we'll get here two Q square. Here I have Q, so if I multiply P, I'll get two P square. D into P minus Q, two into Q square. Two if I take common, two into Q square minus P square by PQ. D into p minus q, two into see here a square minus b square. If I use the identity, a plus b into a minus b by p q. See if you observe here now. Here I have p minus q. Here I have q minus p. So what I'll do? I'll change this over here. So next step, what I'll do is I'll write here. D into p minus q. Right side, I'll write this q minus p. I'll write as p minus q. So minus two into p plus q into p minus q by p q. See what I did here. This q minus p I wrote in terms of p minus q. So that's why I got this minus over here. This one. So now. Because a minus b, I can write as minus b plus a. Same. Minus if I take common b minus a. So a minus b, if I want to write as b minus a, will get minus here. So that minus is only over here. So the next one is next step. Now p minus q, p minus q cancel. So d value is minus two into p plus q by p q. Now. I need to find S P plus sum of first P plus Q terms. Now see here to solve that. 
s p plus q so if i use this formula is a sum of n terms p plus q by 2 into 2 a plus n in place of n p plus q minus 1 into d now here see the way i'll explain here like p plus q by 2 into 2 a plus p d plus q d minus d now p plus q by 2 here see the small logic over here in this step 2 a plus p d minus d at the end i'll write q d at the end i'll write q d now if i'll substitute the values over here p plus q by 2 as it is p plus q by 2 as it is you will write it the next term 2a this one 2a plus p d minus d this value from here see here if we will take 2a plus p d minus d is here this value 2a plus p d minus d in place of this i will write 2q 2q by p plus q into d d value is here, here. minus 2 into p plus q by p q ok from here if i will simplify So, P plus Q by 2 into here LCM is LCM is here two Q by P here Q and Q cancel minus LCM if I take total P total here I'll take LCM as P because here also Q and Q cancel so P here now I am left with like 2p minus 2q. Here see because q and q got cancelled. So here we have p and here also we are left with like p. So I took LCM as p. Then here denominator is 2q minus 2p minus 2q. So now here 2q and 2q cancel. So you are left with like p plus q by 2 into minus 2p by p here also see p and p cancel 2 and 2 also cancel so you are left with minus of p plus q minus of p plus q so sum of p plus q terms is minus of p plus q